morning. Welcome back to Conversations with Carissa. This is a haul, you guys. I'm really excited to share with you um, the haul, the items that I purchased for my small butler pantry. This is long overdue, and I wanted to kind of share with you the items that I'm going to be organizing my closet with, uh, the pantry with. Um, and then also, I'm going to share with you, I would have place these items in the kitchen but right now is a hot mess because I've already taken out all the items that is in the pantry and they're just kind of housed on the countertop so I have to do the haul in the family room so without further ado first I want you guys to like share and subscribe to the channel if you're not already a subscriber so I'm gonna go ahead and share with you the items that I purchased now I purchased these baskets here all of the items I purchased were, most of them were from uh, at home. And the other items I ordered off of Amazon. So, as I mentioned to you before, I'm doing an overhaul period, even with my spices and everything, how they are, um, I'm not going to be using the little containers, but you, I'll get to that in a few seconds. But anyway, um, I got the, this, the baskets and... And different sizes so these this size was about uh, eight dollars and ninety nine cents it's big enough for me to see you guys don't have to use my glasses so this this this, this size basket was um, $8.99 and I got about two of these and then I got four of the large baskets and these baskets were $14.99 okay so I'm going to be putting a lot of my canned goods and a lot of my jars in the larger baskets. And I got four of those. And then the smaller baskets were $7.99. And so I thought these were so cute, you guys. I've I, uh, been wanting to do this for a long time. And then I got this small side, well, this flat, short but wide basket and this was $14.99 as well and I only got one of these I might end up it just depends I might have to go back and get maybe a couple of more baskets but hopefully I won't have to um so I yeah the, I got these from at home then I got actually I went to at home and Walmart so Walmart I got another one of these containers here this is of course for my bagels and um, I got two, I already had one container like this and I wasn't using it you guys it was just there I just was not using that say it so I'm gonna start using it and I'll we we, we usually get like plain bagels and um, raisin and cinnamon bagels so uh, so I got two containers so that I can separate the bagels okay so I got these this was $9.99 at Walmart, and of course, I had already had one, and I got another one. Some of the containers I'll have, have in there, and I've already had some stored, but I just figured I'll just go ahead and just stay with the same type of container, and instead of just trying to buy all over again, it just didn't make any sense. Um, these were $9.99 as well. And I prob I will be probably doing um, putting sugar and stuff like that, the different types of sugar in these containers. And um, now this came from Amazon, and it came in a set of seven. And I think I may have paid about seventeen. Uh, uh, I think twenty seven. 99 or something like that but it's called the v top mart the v top mart and these are the containers here they were a little bit smaller than i anticipated let me see if i can come a little closer but they were a little smaller than i anticipated but these are the containers this container and these little small cute containers that you can put dry goods in it or you can put pasta in it it just depends but i'm going to put my dry beans in these and they came in a set of seven and it was one of this two of these um and it was two of these 
and I think that's it. So it was two, all of them came in, they, they came in pairs of two except one. This was, it just came in this size, just one. And I know I'm bouncing around because I'm trying to hurry up on this video, y'all. Then I got these two, actually three. These were nine, these were $9.99 each. And I think this, I can't remember what I paid for this, but I got these at home, uh, not, at Walmart. I got these at Walmart. And I don't eat a lot of cereal, but when I feel like I want some, then I'll eat them. My husband, he he's kind of average too. But we have these here just in case the kids come or what have you, the, the grandkids or what have you. So at least we'll have them, uh, them already set up. So these are going to be for cereal. Okay? All right. Um, I'm bouncing around, y'all. So, but just forgive me because I'm rushing. Okay, so I got two of these spice savers i uh the spice savers that i have now i've had those for about six years and i'm about tired of them so i want to do something a little different so i got this little spice saver i got two of them and this is kind of how it looks y'all i thought that was kind of cute you can put they said it holds up to about 40 spices on here and then you can just put your other little spices on the uh, inside of this and it also rotates as well um Ooh, I think I, I got this from uh, off of Amazon and y'all, y'all going to kill me, but I got it from Amazon. I think I spent about $17.99 for this. $17.99. I know it wasn't, no, I, it wasn't near $20, so it was about $17.99. And I got two of these and it's the Spice Spinner and I just thought this was kind of neat and um, just to organize my spices like the spices that I usually bake with and then the spices that I usually really, you know, kind of cook with or what have you. So I got two of these. And then I got some extra, um, extra containers. I got some extra containers because, you know, um, this is just going to be like an overflow, an overflow of other items that I may have. I may have like flour because we always like to buy a lot of flour because I do a lot of baking. I do a lot of, I just do a lot of baking. So um, it, this will be an, an overflow. It'll be an overflow for uh, sugar and stuff like that. But any other items that cannot get into these containers will be, this will be the overflow. And I spent about uh, 8 99 from at home okay so last but not least well I got two more things I just got these in today I was looking forward to these y'all and I think I may have spent this this came from Amazon and I got these little jars they kind of look different than what I thought they were but it's okay I'm gonna work with it anyway but I got these because I'm going to take my um, the, the spices out of the container and just put them in here and just label them. But I thought these was very cute. And um, I'm just going to switch these out. And it comes with the little top, the little thing that you kind of shake out. But it comes with this. And I... I, I like them we'll see how they work but yeah and then it has little labels on it to where you could um, you can just label your 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 spices or what have you and I got about let me see how many came in here I think oh some of them are kind of different sizes which is kind of interesting but I got about 14, I don't know why they came in 14, but it's 14 in a box, and they're from Amazon. And so now, last but not least, and you see this big old thing over here, and I got this because I needed it. Well, all of it I need. Okay, so I got this, actually I got it with a little price off because um, this thing is broke. So, but I got this, 
I don't know if you can see the whole thing. And of course, this is going to be for my potatoes and onions and white potatoes and and sweet potatoes. So I got this as uh, and anything else I want to put in here uh, that's fresh uh, vegetables. Uh, yeah, so I got I went ahead and got this and it was about forty four dollars, but I didn't spend that. I think I got about fifteen percent off of this because of the handle is broken. Um, but yeah, this is all that I got for this this uh, haul, and I think I spent about maybe close to two hundred. Well, I know it's two hundred, but maybe a little over two hundred. Um, and I I want to say that I probably won't spend after it's all said and done no more than about two fifty just uh, for the items to organize the closet. And I can't wait for you guys to see it. Now that's going to be done in two different phases because right now I'm trying to go through the stuff that we have and have in the pantry that has been, it's really bad. I'm not going to put it on Roderick because I've done it before as well many a times where we go and we keep buying stuff over and over again rather than, uh, you know, looking in the closet pantry and seeing what you got. But for us, it just got so bad. It just got overwhelming. It was just stuff was just falling all over the place. And I said, this is the time for me to start organizing this pantry. So I'm really excited to share that with you in a later video. And as I mentioned to you before, it's going to be in two different phases because um, right now, the racks that I have in there now, I really don't like them. They come with that wire rack. I want to take that out completely. I don't have a racks in there as it is, and I just want to put regular shelving in there and also include additional shelving for, um, for storage space. So I'm really excited about uh, doing that, and I can't wait for you guys to see it as well. So this is the end of the haul, y'all. So stay tuned, and please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And I hope this is going to give you some ideas to get your pantry in order, too. And this is, as I mentioned last year, the end of last year, that I am working on a series on health and wellness, and this is a part of that. Now, when I share with you guys what I have in my pantry, I am ashamed, but I'm quite sure some of you all have it in your pantry as well. But we are going to do better. We're going to do better. We're going to uh, take care of our bodies because, as I mentioned before, God only gave you one body, and it's up to you to take care of it. So, and... Roderick and I made it a vow that we were going to get on board and get our get our stuff back in gear so we can I need to drop some of these pounds y'all but this ain't no COVID weight this is after COVID this is <laughs> this is after, after COVID so I'm not even gonna blame it on COVID but I'm gonna be sharing with you guys um, my regimen and, and how I what I'm eating healthy food again healthy food what I'm eating my exercise regimen and just all of that my meditation all of that i'm excited and i'm looking forward to this beautiful year you guys so don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel and i'll see you on the other side have a great day